All right, hello there. Today we're gonna to do something a little bit different. I have to do a little bit of maintenance on the Montero. I'd rather be working on the, uh, the big truck, but we need some new brake pads on the Montero. They are definitely screaming at me to be fixed. Here's what we got going on. I am gonna to try to upgrade the brakes. Uh, we're going with carbon ceramic pads, front and rear, and new rotors in the rear. Uh, they didn't, I wasn't able to find any rotors for the front, so I guess those won't get done yet. Uh, I'll look again before I put the front pads on and see if I can find the rotors. But uh, for now, I'm going to start with the rear because I have everything and we will go from there. I also went with uh, slotted and drilled. I thought that might improve. I know it'll wear out the brake pads faster, but um, one of the big things that worries me is when we're going down big mountain passes and stuff like that off-road where I have to ride the brakes a lot. The gearing in this thing doesn't really slow us down very well on its own. So, um, yeah. So hopefully that'll help dissipate heat and make the brakes last longer when we're doing long downhills. So anyway, I haven't had them fail yet. It always is a fear in the back of my mind. And hopefully this will... Uh, be even better. Let's get started. Caliper. These are in. This is in. New stainless bolt. Put it in with these two bolts. And we're going to put the red lock. Put some anti seize on these, some copper anti seize right here. Right here. Right there. A little anti seize in the back of the pad so it doesn't squeak. Grease on there. All right, we clean this off. Everything's ready to go here. Put the tire back on.
All right, we got the first wheel done. Looks exactly the same as it did when we started. Yay. Let's move on to the next one. All right, here's the difference between the new brake pads right here and the old brake pads right here. So I think we were due. All right, we are on the driver's side. Progress has been made. Taken everything off, we painted everything. We've got the caliper as well being painted. So for now, I'm gonna let this dry. I think I'm not gonna touch this and put this back together until tomorrow. Welcome back to another episode of Chad Takes Three Days to Do a Simple Half Day Task. Today we woke up and the paint is dry. We have our brake caliper that's also been painted. We just gotta put that on with the brake pads and we are good to go for this. All right, that was abrupt, wasn't it? I think I lost a few files, or I just did not record it. I don't know, but it ended exactly the same way as the other one. Pretty simple, just put the wheel back on, and we are done. Looks pretty much exactly the same as it did when I pulled it off, except we got a nice shiny new rotor in there, and a nice shiny black cap on the axle. I think I'm gonna wait on the front brakes until I can get the rotors. So I guess until then, thank you for watching. <laughs>